Bum 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 bum. Good afternoon, YouTubers. Hi guys, I'm back. So I'm going to do again, again another video on my non-smoking journey. So it's pretty much been a month or over a month that I haven't had a real cigarette. Um, my last video you saw, I had bought myself one of those little crappy e-cigarettes by Turkey Hill. Um, it sucked. I couldn't fucking stand it anymore. So, my brother took me out to a vapor shop, because he uses a vapor, and uh, I bought myself my very first little starter vapor. Now, this one has a little dial on the bottom, so I can turn up the voltage of how hard of a hit I want, and so far I have it almost up to the highest setting because this is kind of a weak one because it's a starter. Um, but I didn't do too bad on price wise. I got two batteries, um, two tanks, two bottles of liquid, and a charger. 83 bucks. That's a damn good deal. So I have been puffing on this thing since last Saturday and I fucking love it. <laughs> I even taught myself how to French inhale while using this. But I have, um, this is the one I have right now in there. It's called, this is Lion Head E Liquid. This is one of the cheaper brands. No, this is, um, this is like second up from my cheapest. Uh, this is called Dew Drop. Right now I only have 11 milligrams of nicotine in it. Um, I also have Orange, which to be honest, I'm not too thrilled with it. It kind of burns a lot more going down. And I even turned the voltage down when I hit that one. But, whatever. That's, I got a cute little carrying case to go with it. And I'm getting a text message. Um, sorry about that. Uh, we will look at that later. Um, <laughs> but yeah. This thing I love. The dew drop is really good. It's kind of like um, a fruity thing. So, but yeah, my brother talked me into this, and because he uses his vapor, and I can love this thing. Um, the only thing is, I have a tendency to just twist it on kind of tight. You're not supposed to do that. So it's like, so you have your two pieces. Oh, we're still smoky. I have to clean this thing. Um, so when you go to put it on, you twist. And when it gets to that point where you can't, where you, where you feel it start to catch, you just twist a little bit and that's it. You don't twist it onto nothing because apparently, so this is like a little loose and it kind of drives me nuts. But the guy at the store said to make it loose otherwise, the little tiny holes don't, they need the air escape or whatever. But. I'm still getting my nicotine so it is helping. Uh, later on, I will eventually drop down to 6 milligrams of nicotine, and then later on after that, um, I will drop down to completely no nicotine at all. So there you go. Awesome. I have my other one on the charger right now. Just making sure both of them are charged. Uh, so yeah. I feel really, really good about this. My boss won't kick my ass. She knows I have a vapor. Um, but I'm not smoking a real cigarette, so she's not going to beat the crap out of me. Everybody's proud of me. My brother's freaking proud of me. And the interesting thing about this is um, the liquid, which cracks me up. Um, it's pretty the stuff that's in the liquid is pretty much found in everything we eat. What is it? Oh, I carry vegetable glycerin, 
and propylene glycol, organic and natural flavors. Plus, can you see that? Can you see that? Made in the USA. It ain't made in China. If it's made in China, I wouldn't be using it. Um, so the, some, the liquid's actually kind of healthy aside from the nicotine. But then again, it's not healthy based on the fact that, you know, the vegetable glycerin, the propylene glycol, glycol <laughs> and everything that we eat. It, our lungs are not used to having that kind of shit in them. But you know what? I don't care at this point in time. It's keeping me from wanting to murder people. And I can take a deep breath without wanting to, um, excuse me, I can take a deep breath without, you know, wanting to pass out or go, without not being able to breathe. And I can even run upstairs and I don't get freaking winded anymore. Awesome! Alright, because uh, I told you I can French inhale now. I'm going to see if I can try to do it again. I couldn't do it last night because I fucked up. A little bit. <laughs> Try it again. Let's see, see better. <sighs> Shit, I can't do it. I'm gonna get it, trust me. Oh, look, cleavage, sorry. Okay, I can do it a little bit. Not a lot, though. But yeah, um, I am going to recommend this to anybody. I have the, uh, let's see, called the Evod Twist. This is kind of like a starter one. My brother's, actually, this is bigger than my brother's, but he's got a bigger tank on his. And his takes uh, different coils and shit in it, but I kind of do recommend this. Movement upstairs. Anyway, um, that's about it for tonight. I'm on call for work tomorrow, but I still have to go to bed at a decent fucking hour. Plus, I gotta check this text message. Um, so yeah, peace out. Love, peace, and chicken grease. And I guess I'll check it back in later when I got something to bitch about. Later days.